Yes, good morning. My name is Eric Sanders, and today I'm going to talk about civil service decertifications. What that means is civil service is that the agency could take a position during the course of investigations when this usually occurs is to take a look at your original civil service application for employment. And if it passes scrutiny, you have no problems. But if it, during the course of the review, they determine there's a material misrepresentation, in other words, a lie in your application, they could take the legal position that you were never legally certified to have the employment. And if they take that position, then they can move the agency to decertify you and, in other words, terminate you. In that case, you would lose all pension and benefits rights as a civil servant. The only thing you would be entitled to is your contributions to the pension system, any annuities that your union might have contributed to you and held in your, um, for your benefit, as well any contributions you made to such as the IRS 457 plan uh, for outside retirement system plan. Just remember that if you get decertified, there is no legal remedy to it. I hope this answers your questions regarding civil service decertifications. Thank you.